Um, so everybody had a ticket about the LeBron James Yudoka exchange. Why was Yudoka throwing out the game exactly? I don't know. I don't never seen a head coach get thrown out, but remember LeBron James and the media and the agendas and the the the, the, the reporters and the whole Bronny camp, Bronny, 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 Bronny. I'll be so glad when this guy retires. I don't know what I'll do. Really, I am so tired of his overrated behind and crying and moaning. But him and Yudoka had a history. They went up against each other. I've seen some old highlights. A cat had a clip where Yudoka Brace had been calling him soft forever. Now, let me go back for something for you. If you remember, before he became Mr. Neil Long and before everybody knew all about his personal life and all that, he was San Antonio Spurs uh, offense, a coach on the bench on the great Popovich in those back-to-back finals. And if you remember, Pop basically told everybody to play off of him. They didn't respect his outside shot. Basically, he was self-checked. You know, basically, you know, when you go to the gas station and you self-serve, that's how his outside shot was treated as. So there was no respect until he started making some shots in the finals. But it wasn't no respect. And uh, you remember he cramped up in the 2014 finals, the only player, you know, and all that. Now, that ended and he left, went back to Cleveland. But him and Yudoka got a history of, you know, on the court. And I don't think Yudoka is all smitten and all in love and all pressed with him. Now, obviously a head coach will talk trash, play a talk trash. That's not. But why are these refs blowing these whistles so much? Why is that? And why you throw a head coach out if LeBron is instigating? Because he did. He wasn't talking to LeBron, but LeBron's got the code and he will run up and make it and blow it up, you know. But um, it was blown out. It shouldn't have been any ejection at all. The refs suck. And the Rockets are playing good. Yudoka can coach, you know. And I do like Yudoka. I mean, mean, Yudoka is the truth. I just want to know how come he got thrown out for a whole year for messing with a white woman who was married, etc. You call it, that's not breaking the law. But Josh Giddey's behind. They can't can't even give him half, uh, sit on the bench for half a quarter, half a half. How does that work? But anyway, that's my thoughts and takes about that. LeBron, as usual, drama queen in it, overdoing it too much. You don't could just, you know, <laughs> I just don't understand these words. And I don't really want to hear the audio about it because I know if LeBron has his way, he cry enough. And you don't doing a good job. They thought it was a joke by having him go to Houston and thought that was Saudi Arabia. But that man got the Rockets looking legit. Even Dylan Brooks is looking legit, Okay. So ask yourself, who was the real problem in Memphis? Please hit like, subscribe, welcome thoughts, comments, and then I do respond. Thank you. Wash your hands. Keep your mind clear. Watch out for another. Oh, yeah. And for my money, Yudoka could go on to Memphis. They'd be way better than they are now. I'm out.